So you need to be able to find all of these without a calculator, okay? And be able to use these two triangles in order to do it. Now obviously you have a, tr a calculator, okay? So you will be able to check these, but you need to be able to show appropriate triangles in order to prove um, required parts, and uh, required parts of the question in the exam. So, using your Sokotoa knowledge, and the fact that we've got sine of 60 degrees, means we've got to use the opposite over the hypotenuse. So looking at this triangle, sine of the angle 60 is the opposite over the hypotenuse, and so that is root 3 over 2. Cosine of 60 degrees uses the adjacent over the hypotenuse, so that's 1 over 2. Tan of 60 is the opposite over the adjacent, so root 3 over 1, so just root 3. Sine of 30, there's your 30 degree angle, is opposite over hypotenuse, so 1 over 2. Cos of 30 uses the adjacent over the hypotenuse, so root 3 over 2. Tan of 30 uses the opposite over the adjacent, so 1 over root 3. And then finally, sine of 45, using either of those two, sine is opposite over hypotenuse, so 1 over root 2. Cosine of 45 is adjacent over hypotenuse, so 1 over root 2 as well. And tan of 45 is opposite over adjacent, so 1 over 1, which is 1. So all of these you should know moving forward and be able to use those two triangles to get there.